Well, hello and welcome to Heavy Rain. We're playing as Ethan Mars, and we've got our next freaking clue. So I'm gonna be here. No, wait, no. It's uh, we gotta do a test as usual to um, find words to the address to where our son's at. effect. Um, ah. Okay. A lot of ideas. Oh wait, maybe I can go through the part that was broken now. Alright. I like how the game looks kind of nice in this dark environment. any help from our friends or you know the cops and there was no specific instruction to not you know tell anyone <laughs> uh, this place looks very dangerous um oh wait this door over there is it I hate it when it changes the camera angles like that, man. I'm gonna stay away from those electrical grids, you know. So I gotta follow this butterfly um, thingy, graffiti. Ah, I see a butterfly origami over there. Why don't I take it? Could be useful. Oh well. Oh god, I'm getting a little claustrophobic. 
How did it close? Okay, I guess we're going. This is kind of creepy. Don't need to worry about jump scares. Oh, God, it's glass. Is that glass? Wow! <laughs> Shit. Take your jacket out, maybe. Glass. Broken glass. Sharp as a razor. Impossible to go back. I'm gonna have to crawl through it. Slowly, so I don't tear up my arms. Um. Stupid fucking pipe! And Sean is gonna die because of me! Okay. I've gotta get out of here. There's okay. got to be a way out. I go slowly, right? Is that what I'm supposed to do? Shit, left or right? I mean... I don't know. Oh shit, is this like effect my ending? The match flame. It indicates where the fresh air comes from. All I have to do is follow the wind. Okay, nice, 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 nice. No, 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 don't, don't waste the damn match. Oh, I knew where to go. Okay, I need to go this side. What if I went the other way? Curious. Wait. Oh, I need to go slowly. Okay, and then I open. Alright, left. Together, Ethan, come on. Okay. Okay, we're out. What if I messed up? What if I actually died? <laughs> Ooh. No, what? Ooh, that's a lot of cuts. How am I feeling at this? Keep hitting R1 to the L1. What's wrong with you? Okay, guess we're gonna slide down this mysterious hole. Totally won't kill me or anything. Right. I guess I don't really have any choice. Could be a vat of acid down there. Crocodiles. 
knives and spike the fire pit. Whoa, okay, I thought it was gonna be smoother. Okay. Oh shit, stop yourself! Oh, okay, no. Sheesh. Alright, this looks very dangerous. I don't like anything else. What I gotta do? No way, I gotta go through that. What? How did this guy freaking do this? Don't touch, great. If I messed up, I could actually die, and <laughs> seriously, oh my god, okay, fine, guess we're going through the electric grid, huh, it's a door that says coward, hmm, do I go that way, I mean, I could, right, oh, I need, where does that door lead? Oh god, I, I need answers, man. Analyze. Better have a good look at each one of those condensers. If I choose the right route, I'll have a better chance of coming through this in one piece. Ha. Huh? Butterfly. A butterfly. There's a butterfly over there. That's where I should go. Okay, okay. Um. I must have lost a lot of blood. I can hardly stand up. Oh, shit. Got to concentrate. The slightest wrong move, and I'll get an electric shock. And die. Death. The spaces are different. Some condensers look easier to pass than others. Okay. Um. I didn't come this far to give up now. I've got to go all the way if I want to save Sean. Oh, so I have a chance to actually, like, give up. These condensers are alive. If I so much as touch them, I've had it. Okay. Is there a way here? No? God damn it. So how do I do this? They all look pretty turned on. Can't go there. Here? I don't know. Okay, fine. Is this going to work? Oh shit, okay, I didn't die. That's good to know. How do I do this? Oh god, I can't get shot too much or I will freaking die. Uh, A field of electric condensers. Looks like the last trial before reaching the butterfly. Yeah, but how? Do I don't get it. What do I do? Is that like a switch? What's the puzzle here, bros? This one? Oh yeah, this one looks a bit fine. How did I not notice this? Circle. Oh god, if I let go now, I could... Possibly must mess this up. All right. How did I not notice this? So dumb. Okay, I gotta look. All right. Um. Um. This one looks fine. Wait, I can move. Why can't I move? Dude. Oh wait, I need to change angle. All right, here, here, here. Why should not move it? R1. R1. Wait, is this? I can't tell. Uh, what is wrong with me? Oh god, I'm so nervous. Okay, okay. Okay. So now. No, 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 no. Here? Yeah, it looks like this one. 
Come on, Ethan. R2. X. What? What just happened? Can I change the angle? I can't see. Okay, no, let's go this way. Yeah, this way. Okay, I gotta pay attention and not fuck this up. Okay, L1. God, this is so stressful somehow. Okay, we did it. For now. Okay, alright, alright, alright. Um, not there. This way. Yeah, this way. Uh, R1. Come on, come on, come on. L1. Okay, okay, we can do this, 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 we can do this. Alright, nice. What? Wait, they both look... Wait, what? Do I go through this? I guess. Alright, thank you. It, it looks like it's still turned on. Oh god, please don't die now. Come on, come on, come on. Oh god, okay. Tap. Come on, alright, hey, we did it. Just a few more steps to go. Alright. Um let me, let me just change my view. Straight ahead, right? Alright, let's go R1. Circle. What am I supposed to do? Oh, it's not doing anything. Oh, supposed to let go. Okay. We made it. Sheesh. So we could actually fail and not get the clue. Ooh, that's interesting. Oh, crap. Oh, no. Okay, 50 seconds. It's full obvious that the bottom one is Roosevelt. <laughs> Roosevelt Street. Okay, getting closer. But how close though? As soon as I find this goddamn origami killer, I'm gonna punch him in the goddamn face. Bitch. <laughs> All right. Hey, Madison. Yeah, why am I excited? <laughs> it's not because of the last episode, okay? It's, it's, it's because I think she's a great character. And she's kind of pretty. <laughs> okay. I still don't know what's her purpose in this story. Why is she just randomly staying here? Who is she? Oh shit. Oh my god. He passed out. God damn. Okay. This must be after the uh, the electric thingy. I 
just so happen to be in the motel that he's living. <laughs> Something feels fishy. Alright, go to sleep, Ethan. You've had a long day. Everything will be fine. We don't have much time. Right. Ethan. Ethan, can you hear me? Ethan. Let's get some water. Ooh. Why not? Origami figures. What is he doing with them? I don't know. Playing with them? <laughs> Or you care? Get some more. Or you can pee first if you want. <laughs> okay, uh, medicine cab? Nope. Okay. Uh, there's not much to do. Um, okay. Go to my. Oh, here. God damn it. Uh, You've got a hell of a fever. And all the cuts that I've got. Are those burn marks on your chest? <laughs> Oops. Hey, 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 you can't take his shirt off. Take your clothes off to disinfect those wounds. Okay, fine. Whatever you want, moment. <laughs> Holy shit, his nipples burnt. Alright. I'm just gonna touch those it. These are serious burns. I don't know if I can do anything for you. Um, get a doctor, maybe? Your arms look really bad. <sighs> I need to disinfect your wounds. Alright, alright, I get it, I get it, I get it. I'll do it. Um, um, treat. Okay, the first thing is to keep calm. I'm gonna give him first aid. But I'll do what I can. Um, let's use the disinfectant first. Crap! It's disinfectant. Not terribly good for burns. Oh, I totally knew that. <laughs> Gently. 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 Gently again. E. Your wounds are disinfected. That was easy. Let's grab the ointment for her, I mean, his uh, burnt nips. Guys, chest, cause why not? That should ease the pain. The bandages. Hey, his lip nipple looks fine. Oh shit.
the Maori to... That's all I can do. How do you feel? What about the meds? I thought I could give him that next. No. Nathan? He's unconscious. Now I'll just have to wait. Oh shit. I hope he wakes up. If what if I accidentally mess this part up? Does that actually cause a different ending? Can I actually accidentally kill Ethan? <laughs> I should have given him the meds first before the bandage, huh? God damn it. <laughs> Seems awake. Damn, wh why are you so... You know, why are you giving a shit about this? Why are you calling someone? Like the cops or... You know, an ambulance to take care of this dude? Hey, he's fine. How do you feel? Uh, I've been better. Was I out for long? About three hours. Okay. Why the guardian angel act? You don't even know me. Exactly. Um, memory? No choice. What's me? When I was a child, I was always the one who used to fix my brothers up when they ah, were fighting with the other man. kids on the block. She kind of bros owned me. I, uh, I suppose I like to play the guardian angel. Hey, nice. You said you were here because you're an insomniac? Let's tell the truth. I, um... I've been going through a bit of a tough patch the last few months. It's the kind of stuff you prefer to forget. I do what I can to live with it, but, uh... It's not easy. Still... Um, explanations? That's the second time I found you in a bad way. Yeah. You always seem to be running for your life. What's happening, Ethan? Ooh, should I apologize or hypothesize? Uh, but, uh, but I hypothesize. Oh, I'm just gonna be mad. Wait. Why is she shaking shit? Listen, I'm truly grateful for your help, but for your own sake, I think it's better if you don't ask any questions. I could help. Maybe I could help you. No I... one can help me. You've already done a lot, Madison. Right. I'm gonna go. Take care. Oh man, why you gotta be so rude, huh? I mean, I get it, your son's life is <laughs> on the edge, and you gotta, you know, work for that. Still! <laughs> okay. The lizard. Prepare to make a sacrifice of your son. Isn't that the same thing from before? the same message before? I don't know. A, I'm playing as Madison again. <laughs> oh, fame race is strong. I didn't do it. I've got nothing to do with that business. I never killed nobody. Oh, no. Then why did you run away when they came to question you? Am I a cop? I mean, is Madison a cop? Is that why you were here? I told you I forgot to report to my parole officer. Ah. Uh, when I saw the cops, I just bolted. I wasn't thinking straight. We checked out his statement. He has an alibi for at least three of the murders. Dude, wait. In the in the last episode, Shit. the dude in the mansion, didn't he... I mean, like, just tell that he's the killer? Ash? I mean, you could just, you okay. know, try to get him. Where's Scott Shelby? Sure his mother's here. 
Sean Mars. She'd like to speak with you. Sean Mars' his mother. Ah, uh, my wife. I mean, my ex-wife. It was a few months back. The middle of the night. It was pouring down. Ethan came home completely drenched at about three. I asked him where he'd been. He, uh, he spoke about drowning the rain. Um, he didn't make any sense. There was something. Something in his eyes. As if it wasn't really him. Blood twist. It's actually Ethan who's the freaking killer. But the next day, there was that announcement about another victim of the origami killer. Find my son. I'm begging you. Interesting. This is Agent Norman Jaden of the FBI. According to our information, Ethan Mars is one of your patients. We'd like to ask you a few questions about him. I'm sorry, that's impossible. I beg your pardon. Oh, I can move. I'm bound by an oath of secrecy. Uh. Under no circumstances may I discuss my patients. Fair enough. My job is to find Sean Mars alive, and I don't give a damn about any bullshit oath. Um. I know you don't want to protect him. If you know anything, you must tell us, Doctor. I'm sorry. I can't help you. I mean, it's in their own. No, I must ask you tell if, you know, you need they're to looking for murder. Right. For your own sake. Um, reason. How do I reason? Uh, what? What's reason? X. It's your duty to inform the police if you suspect one of your patients, Doctor. Yeah. Why are you threatening me? I'm just giving you some free advice, Doc. I suggest you take it. Uh, calm, Blake. That's enough. Let's get out of here. What? I'm going to call the police and make a complaint about your behavior. Doctor, you are really pushing my buttons. The only thing I'm interested in is saving. What is wrong with this guy? You're gonna be a good boy in town, but I want to know what I am really gonna lose. Uh, order, Blake. Stop that immediately. Let go of me. Hmm. You have let go of him. Don't hurt him. Hmm. <laughs> God damn. This game is really old, as you can tell. Dude. I'm not gonna kill. I'm gonna. Just, you know, if this guy has a gun pointed at the lieutenant, I'm just gonna let him kill the Come lieutenant. On, an easy way and a hard way. This guy is an asshole. Da, 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 da. Yeah. What's up with you, Norm? How you get cold feet? You don't like to get your hands dirty, huh? I thought you wanted to save that kid. I did. I want to save Sean Mars just as much as you do, but that doesn't give me the freedom to do what the hell I like. So you're gonna stop this shit right now. Hey, he stopped. I'll get you for this, Jaden. Don't worry. I will not forget. Ethan Mars has had psychological problems since his first son died. What's wrong with that guy? He feels responsible for his death. A sort of morbid neurosis. He is haunted by visions of drowning bodies. A few weeks ago, after one of our usual sessions, I found this on the floor. He must have fallen out of his pocket. Wait, I... Wait, what? Is the doctor the killer? Is he trying to frame me? I don't remember having that. I'm confused. What is going on? Wait, I thought I was playing his medicine. <laughs> I mean, usually tells when you, you know the loading screen, Ash, right? I want to assign every available man to finding Ethan Mars. I want a man outside his place day and night. Notify all agencies to start looking for him. I want you to keep an eye on the train stations, the airport, God the bus damn terminal. It. I want Who's the killer? To on his ass, so that if he moves, we know about it. Yes, Ethan Mars is the origami killer. How do you know that? I mean, you trust the weird psychiatrist dude? He seems so shifty. Come on, Scratch Shelby. 
trust you to, you know, help Ethan out somehow. Why is your nose red? I mean, like, it seems like you're bleeding through your nose or something. Okay. Who is this guy? This must be the father of that dude. got my ass whooped. Actually, wait, did I get my ass whooped? No, I, I, I whooped that guy. Hey! I like what you're doing, bro. Smooth. Make sure there's consent, okay? Make sure she agrees with, with doing that. Okay, you don't, don't be don't such a perv. Nice shot. He didn't even shoot. Thank you. Please come in, Mr. Shelby. Would you care for a coffee? Oh, I wouldn't mind. Okay, fine. <laughs> Do you play? I tried once, but I think the owner of the course is still looking for me. <laughs> it's an interesting sport. It requires strength, but also a cool head and absolute precision. Would you care to hit a few balls with me? There's no danger of damaging the greens here. That's what she said. <laughs> okay. Take off your jacket. Grab a glove. Well, I don't want to take off my jacket. Fuck you, man. You weird creep. Checking me out. Oh my god. He likes what he sees, huh? Oh god, I gotta play golf now. The balls are in that basket. Alright. Uh, okay. Alright, let's the see. The most important thing is to grip the club correctly. When you feel ready, you swing. Okay, I shall swing. Oh shit, what? Oh, I thought I fucked that up. Alright, I need to go downwards. Okay. That was such a lame shot. Hell, it's only your first ball. You should try to strike it a little harder next Am I supposed to move faster? Or some shit? Alright, interrogate him, Scotty. Scott Shelby. Scotty Patuti. Ask him questions. I'm just gonna watch him. I guess I'm, I'm assuming you didn't invite me here just to play golf, Mr. Kramer. I hear you've been asking questions about my son. Yeah, your son just admitted to being the origami killer. That's right. I want to know if Gordy is linked to the origami killer case in any way. that better I can't tell 300 my son had nothing to do with that sort of case man I'm supposed well, to believe you just like that for my investigation you have no business investigating my son I told you he had nothing to do with it okay with all due respect mr. Kramer it's up to me to decide who I want to investigate I'm an influential man, Mr. Shaw. Oh, wow, that was bad. I did very well for more Are you trying to buy me? Let's just say I'm trying to show you where your interest lies. How much do you want to leave my son alone? That's very suspicious. How about a million, no? I think you misunderstood me. I don't play that game. Don't go near my son, Mr. Shane. If you do, you'll regret it. She's fine. Have a nice day, Mr. Kramer. <laughs> what does that look? <laughs> it's so weird. Oh, he's mad.
got on 20 minutes ish. We should be fine. Do one more mission and then we'll call it a day, eh? Thursday, 747. 3.06 inches. Oh no, we got three more inches left, right? I don't know. Okay, we're at our next uh, place. Remy! <laughs> this place does not look nice. Hey, is that a snake? One. Oh, it is. Porcelain lizards? They look new. Out of place with the rest of this old beat up stuff. Hmm. Maybe there's something inside it? No? Fine, alright. I guess I'm gonna be breaking a couple of these things. Drop it, break it, break it, break it. Ah, something's in there, break it. Yo, this guy really went through so much shit just to get me to play his little game. Okay, can I check the others? No? Okay, fine. Okay. What's the point of putting all that in there? get better for a second <laughs> Ooh, shall we play a game now I'm not gonna sit down just yet I'm gonna scour the apartment for some loot wait I don't need to loot this game what am I talking about uh, what's over here all right there's no chance of anyone trying to jump scare me I think all right let's sit down What is that device? That's a weird looking tablet. Are you prepared to suffer to save your son? Huh? You have five minutes to cut off the last section of, of one of, of fingers, fingers in front of the camera. I thought it was if my you dick. Whew. You will get your reward. Gotta cut my finger? Shit, man, with what? Got five minutes. Wow, I gotta freaking find things. Oh my god, that that's not gonna work. Um, what am I doing? Why am I burning that? Okay. Now what? Look me, I got a glow stick. Oh shit, what am I doing? Am I gonna burn myself by it? I mean, I'll close up the wound. Um. Oh shit, we're not doing this. Okay, 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 wait, I think I need something else. Um, get up, 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 okay, what am I searching for, what am I searching for, okay. oh, 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 is that an axe, okay, that looks very dangerous, okay, guess we're using the axe, okay, maybe I can collect some, oh, there's a saw, there's pliers, oh wow, great. I'm, I'm getting so many options. How, how nice. I got time, I got time, I got time, it's fine. What else, oh, what's that? That looks okay, I guess. Um. You have four 
right, all right, relax. Yo, they, these look really bad. Like they're freaking rusted and shit. Okay, I think I, I've got my stuff. Oh god. Okay, okay, okay. Um, um. Let's use. Uh, this would be much quicker, I think. Just, just one quick, swift hit. Oh wait, what? Oh god, this is from my son. Oh, that that little shit better freaking appreciate this. Okay. Oh, I'm breathing. Yo, we don't have much time, bro. Do it. Just 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 do it. Oh god, I don't think I could do this if I it would be Fucking hell, man. Oh, shit. It's just, just a tip, right? Just a tip. Oh, it's the, oh god damn it. I don't know. Oh, god. No. Whoa, shit. Why am I cringing? No, show. <laughs> Relax, bro. I, I chickened out too. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, shit. Okay, okay, okay. It's quick. It's nice and quick. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, shit. I'll just stick and call me a prick. Do it. Duh. <laughs> I did like that. Oh. Oh no. This is so sad. Oh man. You gotta close the wound. You gotta close it. It's gonna hurt like sh oh. oh shit, man. Okay, okay. This, this, this. Oh, this is gonna hurt just as well. Ooh. <laughs> I better freaking. It was under the desk the whole time. Oh, if only I checked. Are you telling me I could have. I could have avoided this. Oh, wait, it's under the boom. Okay. That was like stuck in the desk or some shit. God damn it. Would you have done it in, the, in his. Case. I don't know if I could have done that, like, in real life. Oh shit. Come on, come on. We can do this, Ethan, we can do this. Oh, I'm gonna fucking... Okay, 852 something Roosevelt. Alright, we're getting close, we're getting close. Ethan, man, you've been through hell. Like, legit hell. He kind of looks familiar. Ethan, Ethan, Ethan. Isaac Clark! From Dead Space. Is it the same actor? I don't know. Seems familiar. Damn. A <laughs> trophy earned gold finger. Oh, damn, that, that was actually painful to, to watch and listen to his screams. Jeez. Okay, um, I got, I'm going to end it here because it's, it's almost an hour. So, yeah. Jeez, this episode was a pretty, pretty, pretty painful. <laughs> oh, my God. All right. Well, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to leave a like. Comment down below and of course subscribe because I'm going to be doing this until the very end.
Oh, this this is a good game. I mean, like, uh, I mean, gameplay wise, eh, because it's it's mainly QT events, QT time events. But the story wise, it's it's pretty good. I'm curious is Isaac Clark the dude? Is playing Ethan? Well, I guess I can find out later. <laughs> All right. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, see you tomorrow. Peace.